Hello. What might we have here? Oh, you've crawled into my lair, have you? Okay, well, we'll soon put that right. Yes, there's no escape now. Just keep very still. No pain will come to you unless you want it to. Good. Okay. There's no need to worry. Just stay calm. I'm guessing that you have visited me, that you require some minor surgery on the eyes. Yes? Okay. And the doctors have tried everything they can to save your vision? Oh, I thought so. Not to worry. I'll soon put that right. Just let me put my glove on. And we'll get started. So it's both eyes that you're losing your vision. And can you see me at all? You can? Okay, good. Well, we'll put that right and you'll be able to see everything after today. Let's just see what we're dealing with. Pretty much gone. And what about this side? Hmm. Yes. Very troublesome. But not to worry. I've dealt with more complex situations than you can imagine. And not just on humans. No. Let me just peg your eyes open for the procedure. Just hold still. That eye and the other eye. There we go. There'll be no blinking now. Just in time to put in these eye drops. This will sting and it will burn, but it's all for your own good. I'm not going to be doing anything that will harm you in the long run. Just in the short run, but it's all for a good cause. Let's put this one. And this one. There we go. Yes, it does burn and you can't blink, but I'm sorry. If you want your vision back, then this is the way it'll have to be done. Okay. So. These scissors I'll be using to detach the eyeball from the nervous system. It does sound scary but you won't feel a thing because of the drops. You're already starting to feel more relaxed but that is artificial. So just hold very still. Nothing's wrong. Just saying it generally because of the situation you're in. There we go. 
Now I need to remove the nerves from the eye with tweezers, of course. So keep very still because one slip of the hand could mean permanent sight loss. are still intact in the sockets but they are not connected to your optic nerves so I'll be using a scalpel to correct the nerves back to where they should be because originally they had disconnected No, this is not a complex case whatsoever. I've dealt with things that actually have more than two eyes before and that didn't take very long. It's a simple procedure if you just keep very still and stay very calm. They are properly aligned with the rest of the optic nerves. I need a very steady hand for this. Seems to have aligned the optic nerve. Mm. Yes, that will do. I'm going to secure that back in place now with what looks like a nail, and it is a nail because that's the only way we can actually fix things. 
so just hold still and try not to move. So I'm just going to be using this and this to put it back into shape. I think we'll need to cauterise the rest with some fire, of course. Yes, you've already endured enough pain, but it's something that you'll be used to. doesn't smell very pleasant, but that's what burning nerves smell like. You get used to it after a while. Brilliant. Okay. Let me just make sure everything's in place. Sealing everything together and reattaching your nerves. Looks good to me. Let's just put some solution on the eyes to stop them getting infected. We don't want that. I've dealt with many an affected eye as well as vision loss and it's not pleasant, especially when they're infected internally. This is my own recipe, which nobody knows about, because if they did, then I would go out of business, at least for the eye infections. Let's check something. We are getting some response, which is good. It might take a few days to go back to normal. But of course it's better than being blind. You should be grateful that you didn't lose your vision completely. Seems to have corrected things. I think you're ready to have your pegs taken off, if that's what you want. Okay, let's get these removed. You 
I'll be able to blink now as well. Yes, let's blink a few times. See, miracles do exist. At least in the eye department. Just checking, but it's definitely worked. There we go. So just rest for at least two days. You don't want to be using your eyes for anything strenuous. And you can now feel confident that your vision will not be impaired for life at least for a few years and then you'll be going back which is good for me because it keeps me in business okay brilliant so I'll see you in a couple of years when inevitably your vision has gone wrong again because it doesn't last forever but it only takes 15 minutes to correct and 2,000 pounds wonderful okay enjoy the rest of your evening goodbye